Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jimmy and today we're going to take a look at a brand new feature that just became available as long as you have Samsung One UI 6.0 with Android 14. Now currently we are on beta 4 and my hope is that the full official public launch of Samsung One UI 6.0 should be at the end of October. Now this brand new feature is one that's found in another Samsung application and it's called Good Guardians. Now inside of Good Guardians, this thing right here is very similar to Samsung Goodlock. Now Goodlock is all these modules for customizations. Good Guardians is kind of these booster packs basically for battery, for your games, the internal, you know, thermal temperature, your memory, media file guardian. There's a lot of these things that is already a part of your phone. These just kind of do it in a different manner. And one of the features we're talking about today is inside of battery guardian. And inside of here, you have this new feature that is called screen curtain. Now, my hope is that this will actually be a part of any phone with Android 14, because I think this might be a feature that they will be adding in because it's one that's actually just right here in the quick settings. So what screen curtain allows you to do is basically just put your phone, it shuts a curtain, it keeps it exactly where it is. So if you think of everything outside, it's going to stay the exact same exactly where you are it's still going to keep on running in the background and the instant you're ready to go with whatever you're doing you just pull it right back up basically screen curtain does the exact same thing so yeah it's a thing that you can actually put inside of your quick settings on the very top you can add it right here just by tapping on this and then if you use any of the accessibility button options on your Samsung phone you can actually add it inside of the accessibility button as well so giving a couple of examples of what you can do with this is let's say that you're watching TV TV, and you also still want to listen to this thing live. So right now this is playing, this is live TV. And the moment something's happening, maybe one of the kids runs up or maybe you have to go somewhere, or you just have to put your phone down really quick. All you'd have to do is when you pull down the notifications panel, you turn on that screen curtain, you're still able to listen to what is going on. It is still happening in the background. It is a fully active application. And then anytime you want to go right back to what you're doing, so maybe you had to put your phone in your pocket really quick, you're pushing the shopping cart, and then once you get maybe home, you pull it right back out, you were still listening, and then you just basically double tap, and then you're right back exactly where you are. There is no pausings. You're still able to listen to every single thing. This will definitely come in handy if you just need any application always running in the background. The other way that you can have this one pop up, again, you can just tap that button. It's super quick. Right over here, you can just hit that power button and you're right back to where you were. Now, I'm gonna show you just a couple other examples of what you can do this with. So basically, let's say that maybe you're just on the internet, you're going through something uh, and you wanna make sure that you don't lose exactly where you are. Basically, you just go inside of your quick settings, screen curtain, boom. Now, it's very similar to blocking the screen or locking the screen inside of the game booster. So this is just a way you can do it with any other application other than a game. So I mean, another example, let's say that you're just going through, maybe you're listening to music. One of the cool things, again, is yes, YouTube music can just play in the background, but maybe you don't have some type of a paid version. And every single time that you basically lock the screen or you turn off the screen, it will stop the music. Same thing with YouTube. This is a way that you can listen to music on YouTube. You can listen to YouTube music. You do whatever you want to. It's fully running in the background. You just hit the power button and then you're right back to where you were from before. You're not losing anything and you're still listening to whatever is going on. Maybe you're just on the toilet. You are searching through all these different Instagrams. You're going through and then basically you just got to get up. You're going to get out of the bathroom. Boom. You do this. You put it right in your pocket. You get out and then you're able to just go ahead and resume with exactly what you're doing with Without a beat. Now, as I mentioned from before, this is very similar to what you can do inside of Game Booster. So let's say that you go over here and let's say that we were playing Monster Hunter now. Now, the thing is, is that it will not work. The, the screen curtain does not work in calls and it also does not work in games. And I think it's just because with Samsung especially, we already have the option right here, just tap this little button and it's going to lock the screen. And it's pretty much the exact same thing. It turns it all the way dark. You can even have the brightness up. You can have it all the way down. Uh, I think this either goes to five or 10. And then when you want to go back to the game, maybe you put it in your pocket. You don't want to lose any of your progress, especially if you're playing a game where it has to continuously go so you can earn points or money. Then basically now you're just right back into it from before. So if you try to do that screen curtain, it's just going to say that you can't do it, you know, do it while playing games. Again, inside of Game Booster, they already have you covered. 
you just open this up and now you're inside of the screen here. Again, leave it running for hours in the background uh, or you can put it in your pocket and then resume right back to it. So that is it. That is everything I wanted to share with you. It's going to be hopefully a brand new feature with Android 14. It's just called Screen Curtain. Basically, you just tap the little button. It kind of pulls the curtain down. Everything is still going on in the background. The entire world is still happening and you can still listen to it, still experience it, but with a little curtain kind of down, you hit the power button or double tap the screen twice and you're gonna go right back to where you were. Now, again, if you have Samsung Galaxy devices, you're running Samsung One UI 6.0, download Good Guardians inside of the Galaxy Store. And then once you have Good Guardians, download or install that Battery Guardian. And inside of Battery Guardian, boom is your screen curtain. So hopefully you guys appreciate this video. This one was really fun to do. I'm excited to see this. There's a lot of reasons and purposes for me to use this, which is why I put it right there, right next to my extra dim. It's just one of those things that just, you know, comes in handy, at least for me personally. But hopefully you guys appreciated this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left-hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later. <laughs>